come on, do something. You're making me look stupid here. What do we do about the bat? Batman. Don't worry about Batman. He's about to become extinct. Yeah, we lost him. He's nothing. You see, I told you. He couldn't even keep up with you two in a crappy little truck. He's overrated. Anyway, listen up. I've got something to say. As you're aware, and this truly breaks my heart, lads, we've been working with the other freaks to take down the bat together. I know, I know, it's been hard. But look on the bright side. We're <laughs> <laughs> This is gonna be great. He doesn't even know you're here. Come on. Look at it all. Lovely, lovely money. And it's all mine. What about... <laughs> The Arkham Knight, Barbara Gordon. Tell me where they are. So that's who we had. The Commissioner's little girl. I'll break every bone in your body, Cobblepot. They were going to see some geezer called Simon Stagg. I think he runs a pharmaceutical company or something. Do not... Lie to me. I'm not. I swear. They said he's about to leave Gotham. Those airships over the West River, it belonged to him. Put him down. We'll shoot, Bert. Won't do you any good. Scarecrow's gonna break you. You are going down, Batman. Hold him steady, boys. I've been working on my swing. Watch and learn. Gonna knock his head right out of the... This is you handling it, right? Now don't worry, you can thank me later. He ain't got a chance in hell. Oh, this will be too easy. I'm gonna rip you apart. We're gonna tear you up. Make sure you keep up, Batman. Hey, buddy. This is gonna hurt. Can't let any of these weapons get onto the street. This cache needs to be destroyed. Bruce, you need to let me help. I had it under control. I told you, I need you back in Bloodhaven. Now, Scarecrow, these weapons, this all affects Bloodhaven too. The best place for me is here. Look, with the amount of weapons Penguin has been running into Gotham, this cannot be everything. He must have other caches in the city. Search this place for evidence. It should help us locate more of Penguin's refrigeration trucks. What a wanker. Let's put him out of business, eh? <laughs> Seriously? Do you believe that accent? That he only puts it on to sound scary. Let's see. We've got a pile of explosives. You've got explosive gel. 
It doesn't take the world's greatest detective to figure this one out. to be that guy I need to be at a safe distance before I detonate I'm going after Barbara I'll contact you as soon as I track down any of Penguin's trucks Thanks, Dick. I appreciate it. What are friends for, Bruce? Well, what do you know? The old team back together again. You should head to those airships. I can handle things here. Don't worry, Bruce. I'll help track down Cobblepot. Just focus on finding Barb. Now, what have we got here? A good old-fashioned ambush. Oh, you wait there, Mats. Let your dear old Uncle Jay sort out these chumps. to find somewhere I can get a clear shot to take out the militia ambush. Personally, I would have used live rounds. Alfred, what do you have on Simon Stagg? Now, uh, let's see. The CEO of Stagg Enterprises, a company that specializes in advanced medical research and development. I'm heading to Stagg's airships now. 
Scarecrow was on his way there, and that's our only link to finding Barbara. The threat analysis indicates that Founders Island is covered by the militia's long-range radar and missile launchers. The Batmobile will be detected and targeted as soon as you cross the bridge. Don't worry, Alfred. I'll go in on foot and stick to the rooftops. Find me the schematics of those airships. Right away. Best of luck, sir. Riddler's next trial's in Bristol. He's losing Alfred, and that makes him dangerous. Sir, perhaps the real challenge is tolerating his relentless self-aggrandizing commentary. There are five stag and you. And Lieutenant, I'm assigning you an extra unit for guard duty. Who are we guarding? Scarecrow. Boss wants to go aboard. Preliminaries are done with, Dark Knight. I hope you understand that. Oh, had I so wished, you'd have failed before you had even begun to comprehend the very first hurdle. But no, no, no. I wanted you to know the full extent of my brilliance, you understand? <laughs> to fully appreciate my superiority. But now? Well, I'm not going easy on you anymore. Anymore. Another racetrack detective, but please, do not let its unique peculiarities crush your spirit. Well, shall we begin? No, Dark Knight, you are not losing what little grip you had on reality. <laughs> A special ant to crush itself underfoot. <laughs> ceiling applies 300 dead bats of pressure, detective. I invented the measurement myself. I built this course in a sewer, detective. You needed the home team advantage. Just the right shade of black in order to scuff it. No, Batman, you can't grind through solid objects. It's really basic physics. How do you notice, Batman? The walls of inevitability are closing in. Competent boy racer. That's it. I'm cranking it up. Five hundred dead bats of pressure.
You know, I think the wheels on that thing might actually be as thick as your skull. Feeling claustrophobic, detective? Get ready for the final lap. What a fitting end for you, detective. A stain on my floor. Any second now. I can see it, detective. You're miscalculating corners, swerving through straight. Dark Knight, and I can't quite bring myself to stop the fun so soon. Your next key awaits. Oh, good. The fun part. And here we go. Congratulations, Catwoman. You proved yourself able to follow simple directions. Simple directions. Say, Dark Knight, that your desperate fumblings have exceeded my admittedly rather meager expectations. I am impressed. This must be how naturalists felt upon observing chimpanzees using tools for the first time. Did you know, Detective, that the cleverest chimps can even obey simple instructions? It's true. Let's try it, shall we? Go to Gotham Casino for your next test, and I'll give you a banana. before Firefly attacks. The smoke will lead me straight to him. Firefly's targeting the city's fire stations. Find the smoke and I'll find him. We 
clearly have him, sir. Opera has been heard in the north of Founders Island. It could be the missing piece of information we need to apprehend this madman. found a fourth victim. Highly regrettable, Master Bruce. All we can do is hope this body yields some clues as to the killer's identity. That particular type of bleaching to the pigmentation of the skin denotes a chemical burn, most likely a chlorine-based substance. Tracheal surgery to remove a cancerous growth has resulted in the victim being fitted with a voice box. The victim suffered a rare genetic disorder, causing them to have six fingers on one hand. Alfred, the victim's name is Allison Weirs. Hmm. She was an engineer employed at Ace Chemicals. That would certainly explain some of her ailments. She moved into a retirement home in Bloodhaven several years ago. Their grounds are adjacent to a large park. Have you found anything linking the victims? I can find no personal or professional links between the victims, but they each went missing near state parks or playing fields. Try and find anything connecting those places. Of course, sir. I'll look into it. <laughs> 